What's up guys? We're at Tyler's house. Finally got my damn parts for my IQR. Finally. Finally. It's literally been way too long. Dang near all Christmas break. But I got brand new cylinders from Millennium, brand new Wiseco pistons, brand new uh, gasket kit. We got some fresh gas, gotta mix it up. I think we're gonna pull it over here, pull it into the garage with one of the wheelers. Yeah, I'm pumped. If you haven't already, go check out the video of us uh, ripping up at Mikey's Shack, the first ride of 2020. This baby's gonna get rolling again, running. Actually, I hope it ain't rolling. It better be wheeling by the end of the night. No, I just kidding, probably not. Would you look at that? Woo! All right, we're gonna get her in the garage quick. All right, guys, we got the sled in the shop. About to start piecing it together. We got brand new cylinders for Millennium. Brand new, fresh honed, or not brand new, but re refurbished, rehoned, and everything. Renix sealed. Look awesome. Brand new Wiseco pistons. Everything else we got. We got top end gasket kit everything here are the old ones this isn't the bad one here's the bad one yeah so yeah that's no good so we're gonna throw some freshies in do some break in maybe tonight probably not tonight but probably tomorrow so yeah, well, I'll get back to you when we get the pistons or cylinders on. Hey guys, didn't take video of this because I'm very tedious with this stuff and I want to do it right. Got cylinders and pistons on. Cylinders are not tightened down. Well, I mean they're snug, kind of. Finger tight. Uh, Nico's pulling in his side, I believe. Just fixed his one. Just fixed his other side. <laughs> So yeah, we're gonna keep going on this. Next, I think I'm gonna put the hurts. power valves in, then the head. I think I'll have a little more room then. And yeah, we're dang near done. There ain't that much left, to be honest. Let's see, we got a little bit. That box thing's empty. I got my head, exhaust, I don't know what's in here, power valves. Yeah, two stroke life, we're dang near done. So yeah. We're almost done here. We'll get back when the power valves and the header on. Looks clean. Been tinkering, messing around a little bit. She's on. You gotta torque it up. Zach's here. Reed's here. I don't remember if you were here last time. Mike's here. Jimmy's here. Tyler and Nico are inside. Wham, bam. Thank you, ma'am. And, um, yeah, we gotta torque it up. Or not. But Put the got, plugs in, and we're almost done. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, it's finally done. Got a new R meter on. Most exciting part of the night. Some fresh Dominator in there. Uh, it's all back together. We're gonna pull it outside. Try to start it. You like you, you like spaghetti? Buy a fucking real set What do you... Who's gonna win? 800 E-Tech? 600 HO? Put it in the comments. Okay, baby. Alright. Let's pull this outside and see what happens. Uh, lots of oil in the cylinders. We're gonna see what happens. I think it's all ready to go. It's probably gonna take a minute to get gas.
It's running now, topped off the coolant. It's been idling for five minutes. All right, guys, figured you don't want to watch me do a bunch of heat cycles of it idling, but uh, actually I didn't let it idle completely. Oh, that's there. Uh, let it idle, warm up, took it around the yard one time and let it run a little bit, just a little bep, bep, bep. So now it's gonna cool down, then we're gonna get ready for our third heat cycle. <laughs> Uh-huh. <laughs> 